A unique marine research project was launched in April 2019. Sea Monitor is aiming to help address some of the issues facing our ocean life and our regional waters. To introduce this, so I guess at the core of it, kind of the original thinking of it, there's a strong sort of salmon heart to the project, which is the reason for looking at that offshore movement of salmon and looking at that kind of survivorship out in the open water areas. That's the original idea expanded very rapidly. So to include basking sharks, to include skate, to include porpoise, to include the seals. Delivered on an unprecedented scale, this is Europe's largest marine life tracking project. A variety of species are tagged with transmitters, sending out a range of information, including location and depth, with the data recorded as they pass a line of underwater receivers called an array. The information will help us better understand and protect some of the most vulnerable species in our seas. In March 2020, the Marine Institute's research vessel, Celtic Voyager, was commissioned to deploy the line of underwater receivers which make up the array. Using the latest in GPS and acoustic telemetry technology, these receivers will stretch from Mallon Head in Ireland to Isla in Scotland. With the data collected, tracks and models will be generated to better understand species and the pressures they face. by the LOX Agency and an international consortium of partners. Together, we will produce marine spatial models for each species. Working collaboratively with a variety of stakeholders and our sister projects. For the first time, marine management plans will be developed for Atlantic salmon in the Foil and Clyde River systems. To learn more, please visit our website Follow us on Twitter and subscribe to our joint easing.